Welcome back to Academy TV. We are at the new Cuffery for Wimborne Town Reserves versus Bournemouth Sports. It's a DPL game. Um, first time that Wimborne Reserves are in a DPL, so that's not a good start. Goes up. We're up in a little tower. Probably won't go up in the tower again, to be honest. With the video, you're better off on the ground level with the tripod. But we give it a go. We make it work. We don't get that much obscured. But yeah, especially having a new tripod as well, I feel like I get a better view. Bit of a stop start here. We've got a throw here. Check out this uh, technique from the gaffer here. That is how you throw. Love it. Anyway, we're here for the goals, and there's plenty of them if you know the score of this game already. No one moaned about the game going up, unlike some teams. Bournemouth Sports on the ball. Don't let him do it. He did him. Early goal there. Just napping there, Bournemouth Sports. Sheila, Shelley? I'm not sure how you pronounce the name. Good goal, anyway. If I've got it wrong, apologies. Just stay hello next time I see you and correct me on the pronunciation. There's the goal cam. Definitely onside with the other lad. Comes in. It's soft. In the back of the net. 1-0, run away, a 25 minute goal, first goal. Like I say, this is just the goals, key incidences. It's Bournemouth Sports in possession. High press there from Wimble, they're on him straight away. It's a free kick, but high pressing game, like to see it. Ball gets thrown out. Nice switch there. Great tackle. On the counter attack already. Lino don't flag here. Still doesn't put anything. Then puts it up for offside. I think he got it wrong. And uh, here's why. I'll prove it to you. A couple of disputes there. Lino give it for offside. That's when the ball's played. Miles on there. Absolutely miles on. The other guy was offside, not this guy. Next, I, I didn't know whether he gave it to him for a free kick or something, but I hate to say it, Lionel. You got that well wrong. There's a couple of steals from it. Luckily, as you know, it didn't cost a full time result, but yeah, bad call. Oh. Ref's gone straight to the spot there, it's a penalty. No malice from the keeper there. Eyes on the ball. Just, just hasn't won it. You know, he ain't gone out there. Let's have a look at the replay. Same as the striker. Eyes on the ball. Striker's just got there first. Both fully committed players there. Here is the penalty. Two nil. Good pen. Sheely? Shella? Not sure. First name out much easier to pronounce either. Let's have a look at the pen. Good pen. Looks even better. Slow down. 2-0 then at New Cuthbury. Another VEO camera here. Day and a half getting popular. Sports in possession. They're coming forward. Gets put out for a throw then. We're going to pick the play back up with a throw on the other side. It's flicked on from Wimborne. Closing stages this half. 2 0 to Wimborne reserves. Mixed bag so far in the DPL. DPL, from what I've seen last year recording in it, it's almost like three leagues within one league. You've got your top six to eight, you've got your middle grounders, and then you've got your bottom eight. And uh, yeah, some good teams in there. That's half time. Thanks for watching Academy TV so far. You know the drill. Hit the like and subscribe button. Leave a comment if you can. Or maybe you don't know the drill. First time watching. We're underway anyway. Bournemouth Sports. Need a, need a response, really. I've um, never really recorded them directly. But yeah, I've recorded them playing other teams. First time I am going to be up there at least once a month. Every six weeks trying to record. So Wimborne Town free kick. Go short with it. Gets it back. A nice knock in the box. 
Spilled it. It's in the back of the net. Nixon, 47. Here's the goal cam on that. It did die shortly after this, so we couldn't get all the goals in the second half on it. Header there, kind of unchallenged. Keeper gets it away. Bit unreactive there. Hey, now. But yeah, a bit out of character this uh, scoreline from sports. I'd, well, they still are up there, but I've got them to challenge for the title this year from what I saw last year. Everyone has an off day there, I guess. And the good news is they still want it posted. You can learn from defeats. Some teams should take notes. Keep your eye on this one. This one's a rocket. Moody. Pick that out. 3 1. Well hit free kick. Let's have a look at the replay. Slowed down a little bit. Oh. I'm not sure which team said that, but if, I hope it wasn't Bournemouth Sports because this final score line, you didn't want it more. Wimborne, anyway. 3-1 here at Newcastle. Little free kick there. Bournemouth Sports throw. Should be quite comfortable here. Just that press, constant press from Wimborne. Whoever's coaching him didn't get the gaffer's name. Obviously doing a good job. Oh, he's unpicked him. Back in the net. It's that guy again. It's Nixon. It's 4-1. Let's have a look at the replay. Back of the net. We're back underway. Boom Sports 4-1 here at Newcastle. That went three legs, mate. That's a nuts. Boom Sports go all the way back to the keeper. Nothing really coming out. We got a throw on the far side. Wimborne reserves attacking in the final third. Hands in the back. Second penalty of the game. Oh, good pen. Keep it in the right way. That's his hat trick. I don't know how you said it. Good footballer anyway. Hat trick. Mascarenza, maybe his first name is. Not sure. Could be getting it all wrong. Apologies if I am. He scored a great hat trick. Form of sports on the ball. Can't help but say, but whenever I see a five-one, it always reminds me of England, Germany. If you're uh, that old, but yeah, you know, what a game that was! Not over yet, though. Plenty of time, plenty more goals as, as well. If you saw the full-time scoreline, I got given a team sheet, but in all honesty, I lost it. I've had that many games on the desk recently, but yeah, I wanted to get this one out. Catch up with all the football being off this weekend. No match of the day tonight. Everyone can watch Academy TV. Sports. Slick round. Wimborne looked to break. Great run there. He's ahead of his man. Oh, he's finished it as well for the hat trick. Nixon. Second half hat trick for Nixon. I'm not sure if he started the game or come on, but yeah. Second half hat trick, good player there as well. So look at the replay, slowed down again. Gets up, not trying to walk it into the back of the net. Got his composure, got his shot away. Good goal. Wimborne Town reserves six, Bournemouth Sports one. Weren't expecting this on my night, on my night out in Wimborne. Or what was up with that but yeah it took a knock there goal kick from the line -A. this line has been a bit sus in my book
Goalkeeper sends that from Wimborne Town. It is flicked on. Looks like he had his arm on his back there. Ref not interested. It's in a good position. Just on that break, Wimborne is so deadly. He's way out of position there. Cuts back. Doesn't get a good enough. Oh, Max Mumford felt like the keeper saw that late. He was already going the other way. Kind of got sank to it. Full back. Sorry, mate. You're miles out of position there. You're pushing up way too high. Yeah, uh, keeper thought he was going the other way a bit. That's a uh, that's a seven-one routine. Very unlike Bournemouth Sports. I haven't checked the results since. I think they've uh, returned to winning ways. Mumford ball in. It's been relentless from Wimborne. Credit where credit's due. I'm not sure how close any of these are around the first team, but yeah, some good players here. Not sure the age group. I can say, first time in the DPL though. Feeding off scraps, really. Bournemouth Sports front two there. They've done well. I think Voicey was playing tonight. He had a load of goals last season. Wimborne have done well to keep him out. Touchdown. Bournemouth Sports starting to play. Get up a goal kick. That goalie ain't going to be in any rush to take that. Grab a Bournemouth Sports corner. Headed down. Not panning out for him. That one's a whisker wide. It's a goal kick. Keeper ain't going to be in a rush to take that. Lino stepped in again. Like a comment from the Lino on that offside. Unless I've misinterpreted it, it was a free kick or something, but he got that well wrong. Should arguably be 8 1. Anyway, closing stage of this game. Last little bit. He's going to blow. He's going to blow on the kick. And he does. Fair play to Wimbledon Town Reserves. As I said, apologies if I pronounce anyone's names wrong. I did forget to have a chat with everyone. I was in a rush. And I uh, forgot to get team shoots. That's the league table as it is. Bournemouth Sports win their game in hand. They can go top. But yeah, it's going to be an open season, I think. Not what I thought. Thanks for watching Academy TV. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. See you next time. Thanks for watching.